had a lot of support in fighting the flames from the air. But what happens when something goes wrong? An entire Roswell neighborhood found out the hard way after a load of flame retardant missed its mark. News 13 Selena Westervelt is live in Roswell with details. Kim, neighbors told me at first they were worried about a terrorist attack or even something worse. Now they're just concerned about the long-term effects of the chemicals on their homes. People just started coming out and saying, hey, do you have these red spots? And it was about that time I noticed it was everywhere. The cars, the streets, sidewalks, even pets covered in flame retardant. It looked like something out of the Twilight Zone because everybody just started coming out of their houses. Laura Danley's two children were inside, but a neighbor's daughter wasn't so lucky. She was jumping on the trampoline when it happened, and I guess she went inside and told her mom, Mommy, it's raining. Her dad said she looked like she'd been covered in red ice cream. The Bureau of Land Management says an air tanker had a door malfunction. It was on its way to the crooked Creek fire burning near Artesia when about a thousand gallons of flame retardant slipped out and fell on the Danley's neighborhood. I've been here uh, just over 20 years and uh, this is the first time this has occurred in Roswell. Basically it was getting out there with waters and scrub brushes and, and folks and uh, just hitting every car fence and you know if the, neighbor, if the neighborhood folks wanted us in their backyard scrubbing on a trampoline if that was it then we we're gonna do anything we could to get it off. BLM crews have been out there ever since cleaning up the mess. They say the chemical is safe for humans and animals and shouldn't have any lasting effects. Some residents are worried, though. We thought it was pretty funny, and then we started noticing that a lot of the bird poop everywhere had purple in it. It was just purple and white. I, uh, that's not normal. <laughs> Now, the chemical is supposed to be non-corrosive, and the retardant can be irritating to people's eyes and skin, but studies show it shouldn't affect your lungs. Researchers say it's only harmful if swallowed in very large doses, and the BLM said there wasn't enough of it on the ground to worry anyone. Back to you. Okay, thanks, Selena. Now, the retardant is made of ammonia, salt, and a type of clay. Experts say it will actually make a good fertilizer.